I'm intimately engaged with all the subjects of my paintings. I use drawing in the moment and from observation to capture the energy and vitality of my encounters with my partner, my cat, and our shared environment. A sense of touch, intimacy, and closeness are crucial to my practice as I translate the drawings into paintings. And the fine balance between spontaneity and control, vitality, velocity, emphasis, rhythm, etc. Those kind of considerations of the painting become means of creating a sense of proximity and emotion. I call my painting the purposeless painting. It doesn't mean that I really paint without purpose. What I'm saying is that I was using the subject as a reference to express the painting itself. You know, it's different from those uh, thematic paintings. I mean, the thematic painters, they are using the painting as a tool to convey or to express a general topic or a concept. Whatever I focus on the experience and visual quality of the painting itself, so, you know, accidents happen all the time and I enjoy that. In Asian Chinese philosophy, people have been advocating to be in the middle, not extreme. Um, just like water, not so hot as to evaporate and not so cold as to solidify. Keep in the middle and there is life. This is what we call moderation. In Chinese, it's Zhong Yong. It's a little bit like the Aristotle's the golden mean. This moderation idea is reflected in painting as being moderate and balanced. Everything is about balance, no matter is color, light and shadow, or shapes, form. It's all about balance. Some people ask me about why I paint figures in blue. Actually, in the beginning, I didn't think so much. It was just that I happen to have a lot of blue paint. But gradually, I realized that people often associate blue with words such as sadness, negativity, and coldness. Especially recently, the Black Lives Matter and Stop Asian Hate protest. You know, a lot of hate crimes happened, and some people have prejudice and hatred towards individuals who are just different from their own skin color. It's all related to people's stereotypes about color. The subject in the painting is my partner, an Asian woman, and I paint her in blue. I hope to break people's stereotypes about skin, color, and the shackle of the culture, gender, and race. In my paintings, color is never a problem or a deliberate metaphor. Blue is just blue, and blue is freedom.